head over to search and then type in run. Once you're on it, type in services.msc. Once you're on it, you wanna click on any service and then type in NVI on your keyboard. Once you see NVIDIA Display Container LS, click on the drop down and make sure that it's automatic. Once it's automatic, click on apply and okay. If it's not running over here, you wanna right click on it and then click on start, make sure that it's running. For the second method, type in NVIDIA login on any browser, then we're gonna click on this one. And then you can log in right here. And then once you've logged in on the web, you can then open up GeForce Experience and try to log in again. For the third method, you wanna make sure that your date and time on your computer or your laptop is correct. For some reason, if it's not correct, then it won't let you log in, so make sure it's correct. For the fourth method, we're gonna clear the DNS cache on Microsoft Windows. So head over to search and then type in run, and then type CMD, click on okay. Once you're on command prompt, we're gonna type in IP config space slash flush DNS, and click on enter. And then that's how you do it. For the last method, we're gonna uninstall and reinstall GeForce Experience. So head over to search and then type in add or remove programs. Once you're on it, you wanna scroll down and then you wanna delete everything that, that says NVIDIA on it, apart from the control panel, but delete everything else and just reinstall NVIDIA GeForce Experience how you did before.